Now, your two works for you weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. Good Saturday morning. Flood watches still remain in effect for those areas shaded in green where we saw the most amount of rainfall in a short amount of time. In fact, six hours. That's all it took for some of these areas to receive upward of four inches of rainfall. Yes, I'm talking about you guys over in Osage County. We also saw over in Pryor right around three inches in that short amount of time. So that's concern for why we are seeing those flood watches. Those remain in effect until noon, but I wouldn't be surprised if we see some of those extended after how much rainfall we received, and we're not quite done yet. That system is making its way out. It was taking its sweet time, and it was hanging over the area, allowing for that rainfall to really take hold. We'll get a little bit of a break in that precipitation for today. Not so much with that cloud deck as we head into the afternoon. The winds will start to pick up as well, so we'll still get those temperatures on the rise for today. I look for those of you that weren't dealing with that stubborn system that dumped a lot of rainfall. You're going to be dealing with some areas of fog, and that includes us right here in Tulsa County. There's that dense fog advisory actually pushed it back a little bit further, so that's some welcome news. But I'm still seeing some pockets of fog, so allow a little extra time. It won't be with us much longer, especially with those winds picking up. Check out this live look. I'm staying off for a second. You can see that camera shaking as those winds are starting to pick up here and looking out at downtown. Cloudy skies. We'll get a few breaks. Some clouds will be peaking through. Don't get me wrong. 60 degrees. Our temperatures are on the rise. We actually went up a degree within the last half hour. Seeing those dew points in those upper 50s, that humidity is set in place. East southeast winds are in play and those will continue to pick up for today. McAllister already at 70 degrees. Very warm conditions for this time of the year. 60 over in Rogers, 58 in Tahlequah, 52. Good morning, Bartlesville, 57, as we're seeing over to Bristow and extending that into Stillwater and Stigler. We'll keep those highs headed towards those 70s in most locations for today. How about near 80 degree warmth the further south you are? So those south winds are really going to tap into a warmer air mass. Normal average for this time of the year, right around 61 degrees. So big jump in those temperatures. And that's going to be in a short amount of time. I am tracking our next round of rainfall. Not only rainfall, but the next round of some thunderstorms as well. Not looking to impact us. You do get a break for the afternoon and into the evening. So if you have plans to get out and about, we'll keep an isolated chance in, but nothing widespread. If you need to get the kids to a soccer game, if you're wanting to get out to run some errands, maybe go for a walk, get the dog out too. Looking good right now. It's not until after midnight that we'll see those increasing chances for showers and yes, even a few thunderstorms. This is a, the main event, as we will call it. We've had pretty active weather uh, starting on, off on a Thursday, now continuing Friday and now into Saturday. I can promise you after this system, we do get a break. Let me walk you through this because it's going to have a lot of energy with it. And with that energy it becomes more severe threats. Now those severe threats look to be lining up in portions of the Texas Panhandle into the Oklahoma Panhandle as well. So really keeping a close watch on that. Notice those winds as they're coming together, those south winds driving in our area, north winds behind that. So those two air masses combining going to create a lot of issues. We'll be dealing with some showers and a few thunderstorms, but good news, by the time it reaches us, it's going to be breaking apart. We won't be able to uh, hold any severe weather activity at this hour. That's what it's looking like. So that is some welcome news. 65 for your Sunday. That system will make its way out. We'll get some clearing.